So I'm going to read this from the web page gotquestions.org. Question What is Christian Gnosticism? There is actually no such thing as Christian Gnosticism because true Christianity and Gnosticism are mutually exclusive systems of belief. The principles of Gnosticism contradict what it means to be a Christian. Therefore, while some forms of Gnosticism may claim and to be Christian, they are in fact decidedly non-Christian. Gnosticism was perhaps the most dangerous heresy that threatened the early church during the first three centuries. Influenced by such philosophers as Plato, Gnosticism is based on two false premises. First, it espouses a dualism regarding spirit and matter. Gnostics assert that matter is inherently evil and spirit is good. As a result of this presupposition, Gnostics believe anything done in the body, even the grossest sin, has no meaning because real life exists in the spirit realm only. Second, Gnostics claim to possess an elevated knowledge, a higher truth, known only to a certain few. Gnosticism comes from the Greek word gnosis, which means to know. Gnostics claim to possess a higher knowledge, not from the Bible, but acquired on some mystical higher plane of existence. Gnostics see themselves as a privileged class, elevated above everybody else and by their higher and deeper knowledge of God. To discredit the idea of any compatibility between Christianity and Gnosticism, one has only to compare their teachings on the main doctrines of the faith. On the matter of salvation, Gnosticism teaches that salvation is gained through the acquisition of divine knowledge which frees one from the ill illusions of darkness. Although the claim to follow Jesus Christ and his original teachings, Gnostics contradict him at every turn. Jesus said nothing about salvation through knowledge, but by faith in him as Savior from sin. For it is by grace you have been saved through faith, and this not from yourselves, it is the gift of God, not by works so that no one can boast. Ephesians 2.8 Furthermore, the salvation Christ offers is free and available to everyone. John 3.16 Not just a few, select few, who have acquired a special revelation. Christianity asserts that there is one source of truth and that is the Bible, the inspired inherent, inerrant word of the living God, the only infallible rule of faith and practice. John 17, Timothy, Hebrews. 
it is God's written revelation to mankind and is never superseded by man's thoughts, ideas, writings or visions. The Gnostics, on the other hand, use a variety of early heretical writings <laughs> heretical writings known as the Gnostic Gospels <laughs> prohibited censored a collection of forgeries claiming a to be lost books of the Bible. Thankfully the early church fathers were nearly un anonymous and recognizing these Gnostic scrolls as fraudulent <laughs> forgeries that espouse false doctrines about Jesus Christ's salvation, God and every other crucial Christian truth. By the way, watch my video so confiscator video number 12 uh, 13 sorry, number 13 there are countless contradictions between the Gnostic Gospels and the Bible even when the so-called Christian Gnostics quote from the Bible, they rewrite verses and parts of verses to harmonize with their philosophy, a practice that is strictly forbidden and warned against by scripture. Deuteronomy, yeah. Proverbs, Revelation. The person of Jesus is another idea where Christianity and Gnosticism drastically differ. The Gnostics believe that Jesus' physical body was not real but only seemed to be physical and that his spirit descended upon him at his baptism but left him just before his crucifixion. Such views destroy not only the true humanity of Jesus, but also the atonement, for Jesus must not only have been a truly God, but also the truly human and physical real man who actually suffered and died upon the cross in order to be the acceptable substitutionary sacrifice for sin. Hebrews. The biblical view of Jesus affirms his complete humanity as well as his full deity. Gnosticism is based on a mystical, intuitive, subjective, inward, emotional approach to, to truth which is not new at all. It is very old, going back in some form to the Garden of Eden where Satan questioned God and the words he spoke and convinced Eden. Adam and Eve to reject them and accept a lie. He does the same thing today as he prowls around like a roaring lion looking for someone to devour. 1 Peter. He still calls. God and the Bible into question and catches in his web those who are either naive and scripturally informed, uninformed, sorry, 
or who are seeking some personal revelation to make them feel special, unique and superior to others. Let us follow the Apostle Paul who says to test everything. Hold on unto the good. Thessal 1 Thessalonians 5. And this we do by comparing everything to the word of God, the only truth. Recommended sources and the Gnostic Empire strikes back. An old heresy for the New Age by Peter Jones and Locus Bible Software. En este momento el precio de Bitcoin es muy económico. Uh, at the moment the price of Bitcoin is very cheap. Pero casi todo el mundo tiene muy poco dinero para invertir. But almost everybody has a very little money to invest. Debería decir que esta idea me vino hoy especialmente cuando vi otra vez una chica ahí pidiendo dinero por la calle. Actually, I must say first this idea today I got especially when I saw again um, one girl begging for money in the streets. Me gustaría ayudar, pero yo tampoco me sobra mucho el dinero. I would really like to help everybody, but I, I don't have either too much money. And así que me vino la siguiente idea. So I got the following idea. It's, uh, it's más bien un juego. Uh, it's uh, rather a game. Um, lo que es muy importante elegir un monedero de Bitcoin que solo tú mismo, mismo tienes la llave privada. What is very important to choose um, Bitcoin wallet a company which you only possess the private key. For example, uh, blockchain.info. Por ejemplo, la empresa blockchain.info. Luego, imprimir en papel um, la llave privada y también guardarlo tú mismo. Then to print in paper the private key and uh, of course save for, for yourself that private key. Bueno, ya estamos imprimiendo, imprime por lo menos 10. So now we are already printing, so at least print 10 directions, 10 direcciones. Luego pones algo de Bitcoin, una cantidad, lo que, lo que te da la gana en esta dirección. Then you put some Bitcoin, uh, the amount, whatever you want in, that, in these directions. Y la próxima vez que sales de casa ya tienes algo que dar a los que están ahí pidiendo por la calle. And the next time you go out of the house, you have already something to give for these people who are begging on the streets. Y por ejemplo, y claro, para tus amigos, amigas, and for your friends, of course. Eso da motivación a la gente para aprender Bitcoin y 
this gives motivation for the people to learn about Bitcoin. Y la parte del juego consiste en lo siguiente. And the game part uh, consists in the following. Explicas a la gente, mira, esta es la cla clave privada, que es la clave secreta. You explain to the people, look, this is the private key, which must be secret. And uh, you have it and uh, me. And uh, explicas, esa persona y yo mismo la tiene. Y antes pensaba en cinco años, pero luego cambié un poco de idea de hasta cuatro años. First I thought of five years, but then I changed uh, my opinion to four years. Later explain. Después lo expli explico por qué. Les dices, mira, tienes cuatro años para poner esta cantidad de Bitcoin a otra dirección. Si no lo, lo has quitado después de cuatro años, yo lo quito. So you explain them, you have four years to take this Bitcoin out of this direction, of this secret uh, key direction. If uh, you don't do it, uh, I do it after these four years. So you lose this. That's the, this part of the game. It's uh, la parte del juego. He creado este hashtag uh, BTC4 para hacerlo un poco popular. I created this hashtag BTC4 to make it a little popular. Antes pensaba en cinco años, pero luego cambié a cuatro porque te has dado cuenta que en los Simpsons la gente tiene cuatro dedos. Y Solo do, Dios tiene cinco dedos. Um, first, I thought of five years, but then I changed my mind to four years. Um, did you notice that in The Simpsons, people have four fingers and only God has five fingers. Uh, I'll show some pictures. Voy a enseñar algunas imágenes de los Simpsons. De los manos y dedos de Simpsons. Some pictures of the hands and fingers of Simpsons. Uh, pero antes quiero recordar que um, es muy probable que en también cuatro o cinco en los próximos años el valor de Bitcoin puede subir mucho. Just want to remember before that uh, the price of Bitcoin, the value of Bitcoin can rise very much in these next years. Así que si solo pones una cantidad pequeña más tarde puede ser de gran ayuda. Even if you just put a little small amount later, it can be big help. Uh, no solo para... Bueno, es un juego. <laughs> si la persona lo quita antes de cuatro años, para, es para esta persona. Si no, es para ti. Si te recuerdas y guardas bien la llave privada. So uh, it's, this is the game part, if uh, the, the person takes the money out, it's for that person, but if they forget it after these four years, you can take it out, and it can be really... <laughs> bueno, imprimir también la llave pública y la llave privada, y si por ejemplo, okay, first translate. 
a print and not just the private key but on also the public key así que si por ejemplo explicas a la gente mira si alguna persona quiere enviarte bitcoin pero tú no tienes ninguna dirección así que puedes dar este esta llave pública a la persona mira muy bien la llave pública no la llave secreta das a esa persona o cualquier persona y te pueden enviar bitcoin a esa dirección so remember uh, the public key you can give to anybody and if somebody wants to send you some bitcoin and you and this person doesn't have, have any so you have already this public address where they can send you bitcoin bueno ahora voy a enseñar algunas imágenes de los dedos de simpsons now i'll show some pictures of the fingers of simpson the four fingers los cuatro dedos y cinco dedos de dios uh, four fingers and five fingers of god of simpson Thirteenth of March. Right now, there are more people on the internet than there were on the planet in 1960. We're raising money. And it's easier to be discovered than ever before. It takes a full team to make each one of our videos. But the internet needs better software to help us reward one another for our work. Advertisers value you differently. They say that 1,000 of you is only worth $6. Any help is very much appreciated. Please fund this project. We need your help.
Bueno, hoy me vino una idea. Today I got an idea. What you can do to lo que tú también tú puedes hacer. Bueno, que en realidad todo el mundo puede hacer si quiere. Uh, actually, what everybody can do if you want. Inherently and historically opposed to secret society, secret oaths, and a secret proceedings. We decided long ago the dangers of excessive and unwarranted concealment. A pertinent fact far outweighs the dangers which are cited to justify it. Face the facts, join our hands, make a stand. Uh -huh. It's time to gather plans, get the shot, take the chance. Till there is no one left, stay correct to the death. They can't ever break a freedom, we will never let it. The corrupt politics is killing the system. Cynicism is it, and it's everything that you witness. They tell you what to think, make you believe that they're the realness. They feed us full of lies, and yet we always forgive them. Huh? It's all conspiracy, and if you're free to enter with, you're the puppet. The government's pulling strings from above you. It's time for the introduction to truth, let's start a movement. We've all been brainwashed, they believe that we all are stupid. We believe in what we see, and whatever our ears are hearing. But if you look close, listen, gather your own opinion, you'll understand all the lies, lines, and what's between them. This world is not your oyster, this world is a fucking prison. Come on! happening in our nation. We won't stand up for the fear of assassination. So they strip us of everything. We stand there and just take it. We're scared to make a stand a false flag operation. Research Illuminati. Find out by 9-11. You see they line their pockets. Don't believe the lies they tell it. Find us, seek the truth. Realize we need to do whatever it is we can to protect our livelihood. It's time for us to do when the conspiracy or not. They owe some explanations to the questions that we got. What are the skull and bones? What is lying beneath all these secretive means? Got you lying between your teeth. What's with the Bilderberg? I'm burning your effigies. I'm praying a Lucifer. How sickness can you be? While all of the time praying you believing in the beast. Just to keep up appearances within Christianity. Come on. Why we gotta stand for the new world proprieties? The evidence is clear, we're naive to the lie. 